All right, guys, we made it because it is meat day. When I get to the venue, I think the first thing that I need to remember is that warm-up rooms are always going to be chaotic and it's my job to embrace the chaos. And people will always say stuff like, you need to control the controllables, you need to let everything else go. But when it comes to competing in a powerlifting meet, a lot of the times, the only thing you truly have control over is how you react to the situations around you. When it comes to squat warm-ups, what I need to do is be as calm as possible for each attempt, but be as assertive as possible with my brace, with my upper back, with positioning right from the get-go. And as warm-ups progress, I'll kind of get an idea of how the day is feeling, but you never really know until that opener is on the bar. And after that opener, we're gonna pick a second that sets us up to take a big third. Like we're not picking a second just to go big on the second, we're picking a second to set up the day. And when it comes to that third, bottom line is, I need to do my best to build the total. After squats, it's gonna be a matter of calming down as quickly as possible and getting in as much food in me as I can because I want to eat before bench because I'm not gonna to wanna to be stuffing myself before deadlifts.
bench warm-ups are really going to be there to assess how the pack and the shoulder are feeling and then give me a little bit of a gauge of where we are going to be able to aim. With where training was eight, nine weeks ago, I'm probably opening bench a little bit aggressive, but with where training finished up, I think the opener is gonna be spot on. then it's just gonna be a matter of taking a smart jump on second and just getting an idea of where we can go on the bay. And right now sitting here, I really don't know where we're going to go on that third bench, but what I do know is that I'm not going to do anything to put the pack at risk. So that might mean scratch the third, but you know how I am. I don't want to do that. Historically, I haven't been the guy that's excited to deadlift at the end of meets. Like, deadlifts used to be just a thing that I needed to do to get a total. But with the way things have been going, with figuring out how to pull, I think that's a lift that I'm the most excited for today. And open or dead, I always like to open with more of a last warm up than a true opener. Get it in, get it over with, save energy, and aim big for number two. And if that second moves and the total set up, we're gonna put on something silly for the third.
at the end of the day, as long as I have my day and make choices that I'm proud of, it's going to be a damn good day. Finishing the day with a PR total is for the sick, but I think what is the best part of the day is that I got to have fun with all my friends and I am freaking stoked to be here. So thank you guys for coming along for the ride. Hope you enjoyed this week prep series. Peace out, have a good rest of your night.